Welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Android tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a shortcut to a file on your Android home screen. So if you're trying to add a file to your home screen so you can quickly select it and then it opens that file up, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to do that on your Android phone. This can be great if you're trying to have quick access maybe to a PDF or some other document on your phone and you don't want to have to go through an app or files or anything like that. You just want to be able to select it on your home screen. So to get started, the first thing we need to do is find the file that we want to add to our home screen. So you can quickly do that by swiping up and viewing the apps and then selecting files. I'm going to be opening a document. And then once you find the document or file you want to add to your home screen, open it up. Once you have the file open, we need to open the menu. And we do that by selecting the three dots in the top right and then going to send file. Once in send file, find drive and go ahead and select drive. You can change the name of the document and also change the folder that it will be saved to in Google Drive. But this is optional because the shortcut will open the file up. So once you've done that, go ahead and select save. Now that we've added the file to Google Drive, we need to open up Google Drive. So go ahead and open that up on your phone. Then you might need to refresh for the file to show up. Once the file is there, go ahead and open it up. And then first what we want to do is open the menu again by selecting the three dots and then select make available offline. This will download it to your phone so you have access to that file even if your phone isn't hooked up to Wi-Fi or the internet. After you've made the file available offline, go ahead and select the three dots again to open the menu, then scroll down all the way to the bottom and select add to home screen. From here, you can select add automatically. Then when we go back to our home screen, you can see that the file was added right there next to Discord, and I can long press the file and then move it anywhere I want to on my home screen. Now, as you can see, when I select that shortcut on my home screen, it opens up the file. All right, so that's how you add a shortcut to a file on your Android home screen. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Android tips and tutorials, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up, and please consider subscribing to my channel, Engaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.